a celebration of science, technology, engineering and maths and it's about understanding how that is being taught and learnt in schools and then carrying it through and seeing how important those skills are in the world of work and, and all around us really. So it's very much about showcasing the work of the students that they've been doing in science and technology um, but also giving the students that are here plenty of opportunities to meet local businesses and see how important those important those subjects are uh, in the work that those companies are doing. We're a local company, um, 20 minutes down the road near uh, in Garforth. Um, we're very enthusiastic about supporting youngsters in engineering. I think the hands-on thing is the, is the link that often between people understanding the science and actually getting involved. Um, we did a very simple bit of fun task here today where they just simply did a tyre change on a, on a, on a cart. Um, I've got loads of, loads of people involved with it and it's just fun. I, I don't think young people get many opportunities to have to stand up on their own and, and speak about what they do and, and you know, pick out the key points of their work and it really makes them think and it's good that they've had to talk to members of the public today and judges because they've had two or three goes at it and I think now they're really only now they're feeling a bit more confident and comfortable speaking to to you know, to the judges and to um, to visitors so yeah it's a good opportunity for them my project is a mirror with storage and I came up with the idea because my uh, area to get ready in is all cluttered so I have designed a curved uh, wood mirror with some fabric storage bags at the bottom and a wooden shelf underneath. Well it's interesting to see what other people get on with at school and because we spend so much time working for our GCC projects it's just really good to get out and see other people's projects. Uh, well basically this is a quadcopter. Its main purpose is for aerial photography or to check on wildlife. For example, you could have sheep in a field that you wanted to check up on. You could fly this at a high altitude and take a pan view of all the sheep in your field or something like that. I have an interest in uh, mechanical engineering, a bit of programming and electronics. They all come in together to create um, this quadcopter. You get to kind of put your uniqueness into a project do what you want rather than sitting in a classroom where you might not be interested in certain thing you're making if you're not interested in woodwork or something like that. You can always have your own interest into your design.